to my Toyota Chaser which on the 15th to the 16th of April will be at Petrol Hedonism Underground. There's links to tickets down below. Adam C 15 gets you 15% off tickets and there are options for meet and greet if you don't want to just see the Chaser you want to meet me as well. And then after then I'm going to do something very special to this car to build it ready for Adam C Fest on the 1st of May. There's tickets for that down low as well and uh, the big reveal will be at Adam Seafest. But today's show is Yakushi's show at Podium Place and the query I have is, is this a bit sad wearing my Everyone Loves the White Chaser hoodie whilst in the Chaser? Because um, links to the merch are down below too. But I'll catch up if you want. I'm closer and we can see what Japanese cars turn up today. I don't know where I'm going. We're stuck behind a jazz. Oh, I don't know where we're going either. Oh, uh, uh, that way. Follow the jazz. Stuck behind the jazz. Stuck behind the... Oh, we can overtake the jazz. Oh, oh, oh. Good. We've also got the new Sunstrip in place. It'll be my first show with the Sunstrip, which is advertising Adam Seafest and the little tweaks I did at Liberty Raps recently. Oh, we got... Oh, no. Oh. Oh, oh dear. It's an ambulance, it's fine. <laughs> let's follow the ambulance around the corner. Come on, let's get the emergency. Yeah, that's right. He's speeding. I think there's a bit of traffic because it's going to be a busy one. Oh, wow, there are a lot of cars and I think, are they being turned away? Oh, no. Wow, look at this colourful RX-8 on the front. Oh, my God. The R32 has been turned away. That means they'll turn away the chase. Oh no, he's pulling in. Also, I've got new tints on the window and I've been recommended not to put the windows down. So I'm gonna do some awkward like talking with the door open to people when I arrive. And it's a shame because we can't hear the turbo quite as well. You can hear it, but just not quite as well. Because of the tints. Because of the tints in the window, meaning you can't hear the turbo quite as well. Oh no, how awkward. Someone else has brought a white chaser and the number plate says, Psst, Psst. everyone loves them. Oh no. There's no more space. Is there no more space at all? No. Seriously? Yeah, if you just park next there, buddy. Yeah? We're going to start the next um, car park there. Okay. Rejected! But this is for Kennett's water only. How could we possibly park here? Oh well. And this is my Lord timepiece that I'm wearing today, who have sponsored this video, giving you 10% off using Adam C by following the Lord timepiece link in the video's description below. So I'm blaming Chloe for this, because we're just that little bit late. Well, we're on the dot, but that wasn't enough. So all the other cars are pulling into our car park, including the non-Japanese cars. And here is the Chaser with the Civic parking the other way around. I thought I'd go kind of front to the road, but it doesn't matter too much. There's my Adam Seafest sunstrip and my flies are undone. But look, I'm showing off my clear lenses. We took the tins off and it looks much cleaner. So here is the S2000. It was a couple of cars behind us. Little spoon logo there. I'm guessing it's a spoon body kit on it. I'm not overly clued up on my S2000 body kit. Spoiler on the rear as well. A Type S. We have the Odyssey as well next to the BRZ and the RX-8 and a little MX-5 too. There's the Gate Crasher. There's a Subaru and there's where we're meant to be parked by the other white chaser that everyone apparently doesn't love. We've got some like fancy dials on the dashboard in white as well. Hmm, liking that next to the sleepy Mr. Two. The FKs are taking up most of the scenery at Podium Place. Little Mark V Supra at the front as well. Another Odyssey. Unless it's the same one? There's an E-Type. But here is the brightly coloured Mazda RX-8 that we saw on our way in. Wide arches, huge spoiler, and a new arrival, a Toyota Mark II. That's clean. Interestingly, there is a Chevrolet in here. I wonder if it's got a Japanese heart, and that's why he is in. But I am loving the look of the RX-8. That stands out. That's a thumbnail car right there. We've got the Corolla right at the front too. The Yakushi banner is going up. So let's see what is inside. It is a 1JZ. There we go. That explains everything. Manual gearbox too. We've got the brand new Civic Type R, which I'm kind of 50-50 on. I like how clean it is, but they're still a little bit too 
too large. There's a Ferrari 599 arriving behind the GTR. They're being turned away? And look around the back, we've got a Lamborghini and a McLaren. Obviously, Lambo doors on the GT86 and the Toyota Sierra with doors that inspired those of the McLaren F1. And of course, we have this trio, the liquid yellow Evo, the Millennium Jade R32, and the blue Mazda RX-7. Bit of carbon around that too. That is a decent trio around the back. Next to the MX-5 and the Lambo. Oh yes, the Japanese Skoda has arrived. But now that the majority of the cars have probably arrived, let's look around the overflow car park again and see what else there is. The Mark II is a couple of cars down from me. And they are kissing their GR86, or proposing to it? No, they're rubbing it. Oh yes, yellow is the best colour. S2000 and the MX-5. A Subaru on air ride. Haters are gonna hate. Much like they hate my armadillo. Chloe's enjoying the marshmallows on the side on BB. Not a Nissan Cube. Not a Nissan Cube. We got more MX-5s at the front. This one's got a, what are these called? Tyrannus, uh, what? I saw this wreck. Yeah. And right at the front, the Datsun Sunny, which it isn't right now. Oh, there are some noisy vehicles entering. MX-5's trying to get the wheels spinning and trying not to rear-end the Fiesta. There's also a pair of Audi A2s that arrived together. There's a yellow one somewhere. This is dark green. Do you want to be seen or not? downshift but we have another overflow area across the road with the Cortina at the front of the S15 and here is the aforementioned yellow Audi A2 best color and next to the gorgeous MGB GT we have a toilet One Direction fan over there as well I don't know if you pronounce that sorry I'm gonna get back well, the Cicento oh there's shirt stuck that doesn't make any sense. Fiat. Who's arriving? Who's arriving? What is it? Oh, it's an S15, another one. Spec, oh, go on, park with this one. Oh, he's leaving it there. Okay, so he's, he's, oh, I think that was a stall. What is this Civic doing? Very boosted, I, I reckon. Extremely boosted. Ah, yes, welcome. Welcome to the car meet. There's a white tracer just over, no, okay, fine. I'll see you in a bit. There is the boosted Civic with its supercharger on display in the incredibly clean engine bay and an ST and a supercharged RX-8. And the Corolla's powered by Honda. Oh, there goes the R32. Oh, and the GR. I've got myself a pizza, a dance with an RB just turned up and parked next to the RX-8. And the Chaser is leaving! This is one of two body kits like this in the UK. It is a Kunis Japan body kit on the car. And here it departs. Hello. This is for you. Oh, it's white! Oh, it's pizza, but it has gone everywhere. Mm. Something's leaving up there. People are getting ready. Love that. I hope there's not police down there. Now it's the turn of the S14 to depart. And the Subaru as well. to the main exit here revolutions are being made but down there we've got the Ferrari 599 leaving so you can film it from here instead everyone's just crossing the road in front of everyone today here it comes beautiful V12 so here comes the Mitsubishi Evo quite close there we go Now time for the Evo 10. Turbo 
noises and it's not my car, it's the Mark II. Starts up from the 1JZ GTE Chevy truck. So there you go, it sounds like a chaser. The engine makes it look like a chaser, like that, but there's nothing chaser about it. It is manual, and a Chevy Colorado in general is a vehicle we don't really see in this country in the first place. The exhaust is somewhere underneath, down here. We have the Pulsar GTI R, a car that's pretty much 50% intercooled on the front end. Numerous vents in the bonnet, too. revving on behind them. Nice of them to wait for me to come back to film their departures. So many boosted and engine swapped cars. We've got Nissan Power in the Datsun, as in it's got an RB, and then we've got a Honda Power in the Toyota, leaving as a duo. some turbo noises, etc, etc. Hope you enjoyed it. Follow me on Instagram for the updates, highlights and pictures that I take at these meets and more. And check out all the links in the description for Adam Seafest, Petrol Hedonism Underground and more. So let's start up and get out. Cheers, please. Thank you. Oh, there are some noisy cars leaving as well. Oh no, the GC86 has got a flat. Uh, so yeah, hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching.